Understanding the IK solver, the interactive IK, and the applied IK. IK is inverse kinematics, and it's, uh, it reverses the chain of manipulation. So uh, it works from the leaves to the root. So from the child to the parent, if you think of that. And so really what we do here is uh, to animate a leg, we're going to have to build a model. And then we're going to uh, link it together. And we're going to use hierarchies. Uh, and we can use bones or a biped. And then we're going to apply an IK solver. So inverse kin uh, kinematics solver. And what it does is it creates a chain uh, that work and link everything together into one uh, animation. And so this IK solver then um, actually uh, is applied to use the animation and to control the linkage. We also have um, an interactive IK. And our interactive IK um, is applied to particular keyframes. And in this particular case, we can go to the hierarchy tab in the command panel, and we can choose the interactive IK, and it applies the transformations to the bones. We could also do an applied IK, which is used to create an accurate motion in our hierarchy of our linked objects. So uh, we can bind the end of the hierarchy to the animated objects. So we have these three different types of, of, of inverse kinematics. We have the IK solver, we have the interactive IK, and the applied IK. To really create these, we're going to go jump over here into, into 3ds Max. We're going to select on a bone. And then we're going to run up into our animation and we're going to go to IK solvers and, and we're going to pick on one of the three different IK solvers at this point and um, and so when we pick on the particular one we want um, we pick on it and then we attach the, the next item in the chain, or the next bone in this case, so that how they're linked together in this hierarchy of bones. So these IK solvers help us connect the dots uh, together. So, so the inverse kinematics uh, is used to rotate and position the links in the hierarchies, and we can use different types of controllers to apply that emotion to those linkage. And we get three different types we can use uh, to, con to tie the two bones together. And uh, then once we have that together, then those actions will uh, control that chain.